good day. Today I'm going to be doing a haul video. I went to Walgreens last night and I bought a couple of things from um, a couple of Rimmel items. This is the first time I ever purchased, purchased from Rimmel. So um, I don't really know much at all about Rimmel. But they were 50% off, like all the items were. So yeah, we I got six items and the cheapest item I got was this nail polish right here. It's the Rimmel London Lasting Finish Pro uh, nail polish in number 330 Posh Pink. Just looks like that. And I have it on my nail right now. Well, a nail. I don't know if you can see that. Not that one. That one. It took about two minutes to dry and it says it lasts up to 10 days. It has a here's the product. It has a brush like that, a wide brush. I've, I've been seeing a lot of new nail polish coming out with that kind of brush except for the skin, uh, and not the skinny long brush. So I'm trying to figure out why they're doing that. They're probably trying to match up to Sally Hansen or like, I don't know if OPI does that. I'm not sure. But anyways, that was $2.24 and that's 50% off. All these items were 50% off. And so, what next? I also got a Let's see, a lasting finish lipstick in number 036 Kiss. Uh, you're not going to see that. Okay. And it has like a purplish, brownish um, packaging in it, sorry. And it has a Rimmel crown, yeah. And it kind of upsets me because last time I went to Walgreens, I got this same, or not same, but like a Rimmel lipstick. It was like seven dollars. I was like, golly, if only I would have waited. Anyways, it looks like that. It is a very, very bright pink. The reason why I got, okay, the reason why I got this makeup, I really don't need much makeup at all. Like, I don't need any more makeup, but I had to get some because I'm doing a underwater photo shoot soon, um, probably this month or next month, or no, sometime this month, and. So yeah, that's, and I needed um, waterproof makeup. I don't know if all this is waterproof. I know the mascara is, but I don't know if the actual foundation and the lipstick, if lipstick can be waterproof, I don't know. And the powder is, is waterproof, but I don't know. So that's just how it looks like. Here's a swatch on my hand. It is very, very bright. I'm just going to, the reason why I got a bright one is so it can match with my Swimsuit. Yeah. So, how much was this? This was $274. Also 50% off. Yep. Let's see. And since I got a lipstick, I might as well get a lip liner. And so, this is the Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner Definer in number 005 Pure. Oh, and it's retractable. That's how much product you get. And I try to match it up with the Kiss lipstick as well. So, yeah. And that's what you get. I think I matched up pretty well. I don't know. We'll see. And I think this was pretty expensive. Like, I mean, without the sale, it was pretty expensive. Let's see what it was. Uh, it was $3.49. Yeah. That's like the second item that I got that was most expensive. So, yep. This was in pure. And sadly enough, um, the sale at Walgreens, well, yeah, the sale for Wal Walgreens, they, it ended today. So I was like, oh. But, yeah. I didn't really want to buy anything. I was just looking when I went last night, but... I saw, like, since I saw 50% off, I, like, grabbed at it, you know? It's pretty sad, but whatever. Anyways, now this is the Rimmel London Stay Matte Press Powder. It says Shine Control, and, um, it has 0.49 ounces or 14 grams, and I guess that's a lot of product. I don't really know. And this is number 001 Transparent. 
It says lightweight, long-lasting shine control with natural minerals from flawless matte finish. So that's pretty cool. And first off, I hate the packaging. I know I've seen reviews about this and they're like, oh yeah, the packaging's messed up. And I was like, hopefully mine's not like that. And yeah, it is. Like, it's just easy to, well, yeah, you know. They only have, um, I was in a huge rush because apparently they were like about to close last night. And I was like, oh, so I had a rush. Anyways, this is what it looks like. It's transparent. I guess it's transparent. That's what it says. Yeah. It's transparent. Um, yeah. So, we'll see how that is. And the powder was $2.99. 50% off. Pretty good deal, I thought. Alright, two more. The lap, uh, I got the, I can't talk. I got the Sprimmel Match Perfection Foundation in number 120 Ivory. This was... Um, how much was it? $2.99. And it, said, it has smart tone, smart tone technology. I don't know what that is. I, I don't know. Um, and it has SPF 15 in it. And it, it doesn't have a pump or anything. It smells like lotion. So, and here's some on the container. It looks like that. And, yeah. Hopefully this is my skin tone. You're not going to see much. But, yeah. Feels nice. And hopefully this is waterproof. I don't know if it is, though. Oh, well. It was only $3, so. I thought that was pretty good for Rimmel. And let's see. Last item is this Rimmel London The Max Volume Flash Waterproof Mascara. Looks like that. This is the most expensive thing I got. It was $3.99. Um, and it's 14 times volume. Whatever. Yeah. And it says our biggest biggest brush ever. And it's number 001 black. You just open it. I hate when contain um packaging packages do that, you know? Annoys me. Apparently it looks like that. Reminds me of the cover girl. Cover girl. It has black on it. Yeah. Let's see how it looks. Oh. Why did I just smell mascara? Wow. So I'm going to be quick without this because I don't want to dry it out. Looks like that. And it has, yeah, I don't really know much, I don't really know what else to say about it. I haven't used it, so I'm just telling you what I got. The Rimmel, the Max Volume Flash Waterproof Mascara. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think that's it for the haul. If you actually want to see a review on this, please comment down below. Please like, subscribe, and rate. And sorry about my talking today. I'm kind of just like out of it. <laughs> and oh wait, tomorrow's my birthday. Woohoo! Um, so yeah, turn 18. All right. And oh, and the total I spent was 19.55, which I thought was pretty good from Rimmel. And I think that's it, and I'll talk to everyone in my next video. Bye!